waking up from Ash and John. Hello. Uh, I don't. I don't like that. I don't like the library. <laughs> Hello. Is anyone in oh, here? Wow, yeah. Why did I close the door? There's door and so you know. All right. Someone I obviously mean. doesn't like books. Huh. We're we're gonna be doing. You want to, you want to go fast pace mode? Watch this. Get scared. Yo, my battery's gonna die because I like need Plus it. Is your mom's a slut. Uh, all right. So I'm gonna be honest. I did not catch that when we were recording, but Maddox, how dare you? How dare you say something like that about my mother? Like, it wasn't the game. I know it wasn't the game because the game doesn't just say, oh, yeah, your mom's a slut. No, that was you, Maddox. That was you because you're jealous that your mom isn't as cool as mine, okay? And it's okay to be jealous. But please don't take it out on my mom or on me. Don't just call my mom a slut. Because she's not, okay? Like, I'm having a great time. Maddox, I'm actually terrified. Maddox, I am terrified, not gonna lie. Like, there's noises. And something's coming for you then. Oh! What the hell? What, what did I tell you? What, what did I tell you? <laughs> what? They, they, they took your fan, you took your fan uh, fiction. I took my fan yeah, fiction. That, that's private information. Your dramatics took the, the fan fic. I, I stole their fan fiction. I didn't mean to. I didn't, didn't know what it was. Look, another one. Oh my god, the second, the second page of the fan fiction. Matter, matter. You're gonna get killed by the spirits because you took their freaking crap. I didn't mean to take their fan fiction. It's not my fault. Uh oh. Maddox, help. No. You know, I, I really felt betrayed right then. Like, you could tell that, like, in my voice, I was genuinely concerned. I, I, I really needed help, and like Maddox just brushed it off like there's no problem. He just, he just says no. Like, like, I wasn't in trouble or anything, like, that I didn't matter to him or anything like that, like, like, just, he just said no, and, like, I, he should have known that I needed help, but he just decided to say no, and, like, I, I've always trusted him, a bro Maddox, to, like, know when I need help and, like, be able to be there when I need the help, and he just, he, he completely betrayed me at this point, like, I didn't, I didn't know, I, I just, I didn't know what to do. And go comment stops to win their fan I'm sorry the fan fiction is just so good. I'm at the part where Dora kisses Diego. Yeah, really It's still good. Maddox tells them to this leave me fault. alone. You should, you should, you should, you should, it's your fault, you shouldn't have fanfic. It's their fault, they shouldn't have made it so good. Oh my god! Boots just joined! Boots just joined in on the action. I think if you stand over too long, you're gonna get killed. One sec, I have to read the fan fiction! Oh! Oh no, Boots, what are you doing? Boots, no. Boots! What Boots! Are you doing? What are you doing with Dora's mother? Bad Hicks, I'm scared! But it, it's so good, I need to finish it. Wish to God? Ha, there's no God. I think picking this up is a good thing. It'll probably make the monster appear. Appear. Alright, we picked it up. Hello? Yo, it's the computer lab. My natural... My natural habitat. Battery. Yo, wine? Yo, we about to become drunk white mothers after losing our husband in here? Oh yay, oh yay. Are you saying my mom? <laughs> Maddox, is, th is that you right mom? now? <laughs> no, that was me really after getting saying? that was me after getting jump scared. <laughs> <laughs> but with but with like more that, that crying. Was, that was
See, my question is, like, who makes games like these? Who's like, I'm gonna make a game to scare some loser kid who's just trying to make a YouTube video? See, that's my question, like, like, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, you've seen, yeah, you've heard or seen of it, right? Oh, look, there he is. Get over here. Hi. Hi, Slender. Oh. Hey, Slender, bro. Uh, so, um, I forgot that I don't have a Glock 19. <laughs> oh, yeah, so, you know how, like, there's the Chainsaw Ma the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, right? Like, the movie? Yeah. My question is, so he goes around killing people, I'll, like, I just want to say this now, I've never seen the movie, I'm just assuming, so he goes around killing tech people in Texas with a chainsaw. Well... Every every Texan in Texas, that's in, like a true Texan, has at least thirty seven guns in their closet. So my question is, how did he get away? How did he get away with killing so many people, when literally every Texan, that's a true Texan, has like a freaking uh like closet or like gun safe just full of like. Freaking high caliber assault rifles, things that probably aren't even legal to buy in most places. Texans have them. Alright, back to what I was talking about. So, like, the Texas chainsaw. He goes around with a chainsaw. He's an ugly person. Like, there's no way he can hide. He can't, like, walk out in the open and be like, Hello, I am normal Texan. I am your fellow brethren. I live here too. You know, I'm like they. they he wouldn't be he like. Never, he never did go outside. <clears throat> uh, I never saw the movie, but I bet he did. Like, there's no so way he didn't just like. Up? No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Logan, Logan. There's no way he didn't just like try to pass like a normal person and walk outside with everyone else and be like. <clears throat> Yes, hello, I am normal Texan too, but like, instead of talking about, I am normal Texan, guns, guns, terrorism is bad, we stop terrorism with our 50 caliber pistols, instead, he's probably like, yes, financing, you know? No, so this, this is it. And that's how he got caught and killed by he freaking lives? Chuck Norris with a freaking AR-15 that shoots freaking 9mm, apparently. His family and him are cannibals, okay? And... So these cannibalism uh, cool. These these teenagers that are going on vacation decided to go to this old abandoned house. Well, that's where he lived. So basically, he murdered all of them. Well, not all of them, but he murdered some of them for food. Cause they walked to his house. I'm gonna be honest. You're probably lying to me. I really he feel like <clears throat> no, 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 no. I really feel like he probably went around the city at night and was like murdering people like while they walked around and like I during the day he was like i am casual texan man you know what i do oh nice you know what i do i do some financing of them some of them do act like some of them do like act like regular people but then he's, he's just special wait like is, is this like a true story or is it a movie no it's not a true story i wish it was I could have the chance funny. to kill a guy. Well, it actually, it's actually somewhat based off a true story about how this dude, uh, he, he lived with a really like Catholic family, and he, apparently he, his mindset was so fixated on having to please his mother that um, he started murdering people and, and wearing their skin and acting like his mom. I am horrified. <laughs> Oh yeah. Also, he uh, made he made uh, um, lamps and couches out of skin. Oh well, dude, that's just hot. Okay. Sorry, so sorry, that's not the right he's, response. He's he's called like the the he's flesh called, like, eater. The the, tr the tr like the like the real Texas Chainsaw Massacre, even though it wasn't in Texas. Texas Chainsaw Killer, but yeah. See, honestly, again, it was in Texas. You know, you know how it is now. Any teenagers in Texas always gotta have that weed and cocaine on them because that's just what they do. They were that probably tripping balls, and they pulled out their 50 caliber freaking muskets, and they were probably like, "Yo, you know what? 
there's a guy in here. We're gonna try and murder him. But that guy, instead of having a 50 caliber musket, he had a freaking 22, like a point, a, a 22 long rifle. But it was shooting out of like a high caliber sniper rifle, you know. Okay. So it probably shot so fast that it tore the people apart like it was a chainsaw. You know what I'm saying? Because as a movie critic, I have seen every single movie that has ever come out. Furry, furry this, furry, furry that. Anyways, back to what I was saying. So, <clears throat> uh, about Alpha and Omega. So basically, I think I was a furry as a child. I'm not a furry, I swear. <laughs>